Hello, I'm Oliver. And I'm Lee. We're Bring Me the Rising. I guess we thought about it in the terms of it shouldn't be quite as long this time just because the last one was so long. But I think the last one was um, quite media friendly in the term that everyone liked to talk about it. So it made a buzz. It means we're endless. We'll go on forever. It just kind of um, sums up the record along with the, the logo, which is the flower of life, which kind of represents everything. Um, and Tempeternal kind of means it's when it's from it's taken from the lyric, this is Tempeternal, it's kind of accepting something, maybe an affliction or an addiction or a problem. Sometimes we have these things that we can't change about ourselves and sometimes you just have to accept it and move and, and live with that and not let it defeat you. And that's kind of what the whole album, that album could not be made unless I came to that realisation. Um, I think a mix of like having time off, um, getting to refresh, <coughs> reset and really appreciate what we do again. And um, just sorting like stuff out, maybe internal stuff, personal stuff and just get hungry again for it, you know what I mean? Um, I think it's like, imagine last two CDs put together, but with, be with better bits. It's like a combination of everything we've done. Like we took the good parts and kind of like added a new dimension to it. Um, it starts off with me and Lee coming up with a riff, recording on a computer. Jordan put some drums and some synth to it. And then we come back to it the next day, see if it still sounds any good or if it sounds shit, we'll delete it. I'll delete the shit bits and then write some more good bits and it's kind of a process to just fine tuning it until it's not shit at all. Which is quite different because before we'd write some bits that were a bit shit and leave them in but we didn't realise they were shit until it were too late. This time we've had enough time to realise they were shit and take them out. It was kind of like, he was kind of like the turnaround point for us on this album and he kind of helped define the new sound. Um, it kind of explores loads of different things. Um, there's, um, I guess, like topics of religion on there. Um, there's kind of like social commentary on politics. There's talk. There's, there's talks about addiction. Um, I guess like forgiveness. Um, what have I not mentioned? There's a whole, every song's got a completely different feel to it and a subject matter and it's quite, they're quite open and they're quite easy to, although it's cryptic in a sense, it's still very easy to tell what I'm singing about and every song and I think every, the listener will be able to decode it very easily and go, oh, well, this is about this and this is about that and therefore I think it'll be able to be able to relate to it very easily as well. So, yeah, so it's, it's, it goes further lyrically than I've had before. I think before it's quite introvert and it's usually just all about me and how I'm affected by things and I think this time it's a bit more about how how other people are affected by maybe my actions and stuff going on and just kind of like stepped out of myself for a bit and like looked at the world in a different way I guess. It's just me and Lee usually. Yeah. Um, it's, it, I mean, it's, it is difficult. It takes months to get just to get back to, into the flow of writing and just figuring out what you even want to sound like. Is it takes a month, it takes a good month or two just to get to there. So it's not easy. So it's a slow process at first. This bit, this time away, easier. Once it we, we did it, yeah. Like we did it at home and stuff. So it were we weren't away from home and it were way less stressful. And with Jordan as well, it were it were cool to have a third person because it's usually just me and Ollie. So to have like a third person to bounce off made it a lot easier. The song was just a working title, and it kind of stuck. And then the introduction has got um, is very heavily inspired by the Metal Gear Solid theme song. So we wanted that to be anyone to hear it, to be aware of, that we knew that, you know what I mean, we weren't just ripping off Metal Gear Solid to the name stuck, but lyrically it has, it's nothing to do with um, 
the island off Metal Gear Solid. It's, it's, it's completely lyrical, different. It was cold, really cold. Uh, it was fun though, weren't it? Good times and that. It was minus 10 and you had to pretend to play guitar in snow, so. Probably a mixture of anger and fear and just bewilderment. Um, but they'll get used to it, they'll like it. Not really. Nah, I think we're the heaviest band that gets. Yeah, since like Slipknot or something, you don't really. There's not. It's not. I guess they're, they're trying to adhere to that. They're trying to get metal bigger, which is a great thing. Like bringing metal to the masses, I guess. And we're up for it. So we're up for being on radio. Um, it kind of just a a build up of different conflicting things. You know what I mean? Like he he just had different views to us, and that we felt like he had some strong opinions and views which we felt he was pushing on our fans and stuff and maybe alienated a few which we'd asked him to stop and he wouldn't and coupled with a couple of other things his, his band I Killed the Prom Queen was getting increasingly popular and it was kind of taking up into time of Horizon it was just stuff like that which just led to him having to cut it off and there was no really bad blood I guess you'd say just touring again I mean the weather will be great obviously um, just touring on, maybe hopefully seeing Jonah, that'd be good, won't it? Yeah. Um, yeah, going on tour. We haven't been on tour for yeah. since 2011. It's like a year. It's been a long time. Um, aside from the weather. In Germany, you usually get a review, a free review at the end of your gig. So it's just good. You always want a review. You always want to know what the fans think. Yeah. The German ones tell you, so. <laughs> That's great. Rock on, stay in school. Just that.